So what did Ucrops teach me about parking at church? Well, when I first started working with Ucrops back in high school, one of the first things they asked us to do was for the workers to park uh, way out in the lot, uh, as far away from the store as possible, and that gave plenty of room for the customers to park up front. And one of the things that we're having a little bit of an issue here with at Spring Run is our parking lot's getting full. So two weeks ago, we had 300 people at church with one service, and that was a lot, so the parking lot was full. And so we wanna make sure that people do know where the overflow lot is and that uh, you're welcome to park there. Actually, if we could get you know 10 to 15 cars per week to park in the overflow lot, we really wouldn't have much of a parking issue, at least uh, right now. That might change in the future, but that would be really helpful. One way to do that is to have uh, whoever's volunteering on Sunday morning to go ahead and park in the overflow lot. Uh, and that makes it uh, pretty easy to remember. Oh, I'm serving. I'm this morning. I'm going to park over there, and, and everything. So that could be really helpful to us, and and also to our visitors. And we've been having a lot of visitors come to church, and of course we want to make them feel welcome and give them uh, a spot as close to the front door as possible. So, hey, just a quick um, encouragement to uh, to love one another in this way. Um, and especially this happens on big uh, Sundays like Easter or Christmas Eve. So uh, Easter is coming up, so we'll probably need a lot more than uh, 10 or 15 cars to park over there. But if you could do that, that'd be great. And so what I want to do real quick is just walk over there. So why don't we take a quick walk over to the overflow parking lot? That way you'll be able to see that it's really not that far. Only a few extra steps to get there. And we are heading down the road past the church, obviously. And on the other side of this parking lot, the church parking lot, is the apartment apartments and the road that leads back to the apartments. So all you're going to do is walk along this wonderful path here and head over to the overflow lot. Now I know that if you have uh, a medical condition or a physical condition that prevents you from doing the extra walking you know I'm not there's no expectation of you having to park over here at all um, or anything like that if you've got uh, an infant or little babies uh, as well that's not it but for those of us who you know don't have uh, a bunch of little kids running around or uh, are physically able then we can make this jaunt and uh, lo and behold that's all it took so again there's plenty of parking over here 